hello everyone welcome back to the channel and for those that are joining us for the first time i am boy i am a nurse i practice adult nursing in the united kingdom so today we are going to talk about how you can be a mental health nurse in this country even if you don't have a qualification in mental health nursing let me tell you the nmc has made it easier i think it has always been there it's just that people didn't know about it so let's get into today's business honey my name is Mboi. i'm a nurse i practice adult nursing in the united kingdom so the nmc which is the nursing and midwifery council of this country united kingdom is a national national regulator for nurses in wales england northern ireland and scotland all nursing fraternities including adult nursing children's nursing mental health nursing nursing practitioners and all those sorts of you know dimensions of nursing now you have been trained as a general nurse in your country and you want to come here and practice as a mental health nurse it's possible even if you did not do a psychiatry nursing like a psychiatry measure in nursing now let me take you for like for you to understand in national health training college there is a diploma in general nursing and then diploma in midwifery which are compulsory for you to be able to work for the government you need to have both but when you register with this nmc you only use your general nursing certificate to become an adult nurse here right now you have had all these two qualifications general nursing and nursing midwifery now you want to work as a mental health nurse is that really possible of course it is so i have seen that people are now registering as like most of us who are here we are registered with nmc under adult nursing so i will show you on my screen some of the professions that are regulated by um, nmc but if you want to come here and work as a registered mental health nurse you can do that even without having a psychiatrist diploma so now that i wanted to show you on my screen how you can register as a mental health nurse because i already have a portal open it means i'll have to recreate another portal but i found a way to show you how you can be able to see which professions you can be able to register with nmc and get a chance to write cbt and or oski for them if you have been trained outside the united kingdom so let's head on and see which qualifications are being um are open for overseas candidates to actually follow the route now if you want to be a mental health nurse you don't need to have psychiatry background but if your general nursing has modules in psychology and psychiatry you are more than welcome to apply with nmc and you'll be able to be accepted and relieve yourself out of the pressure that people are having at the moment there are so many people who are waiting to get interviews they have completed english language tests they've done their cbt they are applying and there is no response because there is a lot a high competition for adult nursing but if you want to exclude yourself out of this competition you can start the process of registering as a mental health in uk because you can be able to switch from mental health to adult nursing when you are already in this country it's possible to do that so this means me as an adult nurse i can be able to switch my registration and register as a mental health nurse and I'll do I will have to do that by writing CBT and OSCE towards mental health. Alright? 
So let's go and look into the Pearson view. Is it called Pearson view? Something like that. The Pearson view website, which is a body that holds the CBT and OSCE tests for NMC. And you can be able to see all the professions that are eligible for overseas are candidates to apply for and be able to ac be accepted. But I, I wanted to stress the fact that even if you don't have mental health um, or psychiatry nursing as a measure, post-graduate measure, you can still be able to, to be accepted by NMC and work as a mental health nurse here. All right. After you have completed your registration with NMC, like creating a profile, they will send to you the login details to Pearson View account, being username and a password, and then you'll be able to log in on this website. So this website is for CBT and OSCE. So these are the professions that have been selected by NMC for overseas candidates. It's being adult nurse, children's nurse, mental health nurse, learning disability nurse, midwife, and a nursing associate. So all these are open for overseas candidates. So after selecting a, a profession of which you want to register with, there are practice tests that you can be able to access on the same website, the Pearson View website. You will be able to get nursing associate uh, tests, practice tests, adult nurse practice tests, mental health nurse, children's nurse, learning disability nurse, and everything that has to do with cbt for overseas candidates you will be able to get the practice test on this particular website so you don't have to worry about where you'll be getting information or practice test or materials for you to practice so this particular website the questions that you get if you study them, you will see that they are repeated even on the exact exam date when you go through CBT exam like on an, a live serious note. Yeah, so practice using this Pearson View practice test, you will actually pass CBT. So like five. I've just shown you on my screen that you can be able to go through a Pearson view and get the practice test for adult nursing, children's nurse, mental health nurse, learning disability nurse. You can be able to get the support from NMC through Pearson view to practice for CBT and then get your, 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 your results after you've booked the test and you've passed. And then you can also get your the support from or, uh, NMC when you book your OSCE with a certain uh, OSCE center, they will give you a link where you can be able to practice for OSCE. Now, I want to challenge people who are still looking into migrating into the United Kingdom and they want to work as nurses. It's only, it's not only about becoming an adult nurse. You can also be able to become an, a mental health nurse while you don't have a qualification in psychiatry but if you do have a qualification in psychiatry then you stand a very good chance of being selected more than when you don't have one so yeah this is what i wanted to share with you my people so the challenge is on make sure to grab it and see if it will work for you thank you for watching this video this far i'll see you in the next one bye